Many career choices don't offer significant job security. Others may not offer much job satisfaction. A career change to nursing might be the solution. As Rick Wells shows us, one of the fastest growing nursing education programs is designed for those switching careers. Yeah, I wanted to be a lawyer, but I didn't want to be a lawyer bad enough to go to law school. Susan Reeder worked as a commissioned salesperson in retail until she discovered nursing. Now she's a registered nurse at St. John Medical Center. She works with new moms and their babies as a lactation consultant. The story of the birth of your child is the most powerful story that you have. She How loves being part of that story. Hello, how are you? In this case, Lindsay and Kevin Starr have a new baby girl. And as we look at her, Harper is less than 24 hours old. Did you have a good first feeding? Yes. Susan's job is to help new moms through any questions or concerns they have about breastfeeding. And although retail sales and nursing are vastly different, she says they're also similar. Evaluating customer or patient needs and fulfilling them. The demand has skyrocketed. Kathy Bell is a director of nursing professional development at St. John. She says nursing schools are creating accelerated programs as fast as they can. Programs designed to serve the growing number of people who have college degrees in one thing and want to switch to nursing. When things happen in your life that change you physically, mm -hmm. mentally, spiritually, you need help with that transition. And of course, this is a place where a lot of transitions occur for people. They're adding a whole other person to their family. Squeaky shoes. Susan says the things she learned in her first career have made her better at her second. Rick Wells, The News on Six. The shortage of nurses is expected to reach a million nationwide within 10 years. Now, if it looks like a career choice or career change for you, we have a website for you to explore. Look in the link in the web version of Rick's story at newson6.com. Well, exciting.